Welcome to the introduction of OpenDetect's Dip Steering plugin. Dip Steering is a key plugin of OpenDetect. It allows you to compute seismic dip for 2D and 3D seismic data. The resulting steering cube can be utilized for many purposes, including computing attributes like polar dip, azimuth, and volume curvature directly from the steering cube, to compute multi-trace attributes such as similarity and texture by extracting along seismic reflectors, to reduce noise and sharpen edges by applying structurally oriented filters, to fill holes with a dip steered gridded algorithm to improve conventional auto trackers and to track unconformities with OpenDetect's unique unconformity tracker. Finally, dip steering is input to the Horizon Cube plugin which creates a dense set of horizons. Let's first look at some attributes and filters. Here we analyze the step out parameter of a dip steered median filter that removes random noise. As the radius increases the data is smoothed more. This is the dip along this section and here we see most positive curvature. Finally this is dip steered homogeneity, a texture attribute. Dip steering is also used in gridding and auto tracking. Let's look at the unconformity tracker. This inversion approach flattens the dip field while honoring constraint points. Here we have tracked two horizons in less than one minute. The upper horizon is an unconformity constrained by four well markers. The lower horizon is the top of a dewatering zone that was constrained by the yellow points that were picked by a human interpreter. The same inversion technique that flattens the dip field was also used to create this horizon cube. To see how you can use such a dense set of horizons to extract more geologic information from your data, please see the horizon cube introduction video. For more information or to request a demo license, please contact DGB Earth Sciences at info at dgbes.com. Thank you for your attention.